Welcome to Infigyan my dear friends. Today in this video we are going to take up one very interesting and challenging radical equation problem. It is square root x times square root x plus 6 equal to 45 over 9 minus x. We have to find out real solutions. So let's get started by writing domain of the equation first. So root x is involved. So we can conclude x should be always positive for real solutions. Right hand side denominator cannot be 0. So x cannot be 9 and LHS is positive as we are having a square root and plus 6. So RHS should also be positive. For RHS to be positive x should be less than 9. So if I will take intersection of these two conditions then it will come out x greater than 0 and less than 9. So our answer should lie in the interval 0 to 9 excluding points. Now I will consider our equation root x times root x plus 6 equal to 45 over 9 minus x. Now I will multiply both sides with 9 minus x as it is non-zero. So I will write here 9 minus x. I will write this side also 9 minus x. So we can cancel these two terms. So I can write root x times root x plus 6 times 9 minus x equal to 45. Let's multiply both sides with minus 1. So I am converting this bracket into x minus 9. So it will become minus 45 and rest of the terms as it is root x times root x plus 6. Now let us consider our substitution. I will consider let root x is equal to a. That means x is equal to a square. So this will become a times a plus 6 times a square minus 9 equal to negative 45. If I will apply the difference of two squares formula, then I can write a times a plus 6 times a minus 3 times a plus 3 and take minus 45 to LHS, it will become plus 45 equal to 0. So this is one quartic equation. We have to find out four values of a and remember our substitution is root x is equal to a which we will put at last. So let me write this equation a times a plus 6 times a minus 3 times a plus 3 plus 45 equal to 0. Now I will consider these two brackets all together. And these two terms I will consider all together. So it will become a times a plus 3 times a plus 6 times a minus 3 plus 45 equal to 0. Now let's take the product of these two and these two brackets. So I will be writing a square plus 3a here. Here we will write product as a square plus 6a minus 3a. So 3a, 6 times minus 3 minus 18 plus 45 equal to 0. Now again we will use substitution. So let me write here. Let a square plus 3a equal to suppose t. So our equation will become t times t minus 18 plus 45 equal to 0. Now remember our earlier substitution was root x is equal to a. Because of root x is always positive, a should be always positive. So condition is we will calculate a and we will reject those values of a which are negative. So let me solve this quadratic equation. Let's multiply t square minus 18t plus 45 
इक्वल टू जीरो सो आई विल अप्लाई श्रीधराचार फॉर्मूला माइनस बी एटीन प्लस माइनस अंडर द रूट बी स्क्वायर सो थ्री हंड्रेड एंड ट्वेंटी फोर माइनस फोर ए सी ए इज वन सी इज फोर्टी फाइव माइनस सो फोर्टी फाइव टाइम्स फोर वन एटी ओवर टू एटीन प्लस माइनस थ्री ट्वेंटी फोर माइनस वन एटी वन हंड्रेड एंड फोर्टी फोर डिवाइडेड बाई टू सो टी विल बिकम एटीन प्लस माइनस स्क्वायर रूट वन हंड्रेड फोर्टी फोर इज ट्वेल्व ओवर टू सो आई कैन राइट विथ प्लस साइन थर्टी ओवर टू विद माइनस साइन सिक्स ओवर टू सो अल्टीमेट टी वैल्यूज आर फिफ्टीन एंड थ्री Now I will put back our t substitution. Let's put back our substitution. A square plus 3a, it is t. So I will write a square plus 3a equal to 15. A square plus 3a equal to 3. Let me write here a square plus 3a equal to 15. First quadratic equation and a square plus 3a equal to 3. So let us write all the term to one side. 3a minus 15 equal to zero, and this equation a square plus 3a minus 3 equal to zero. Remember, a negative we will reject. a equal to minus b minus 3 plus minus under the root b square. 3 square is 9 minus 4ac plus 4 times 15 60. 2. Here also minus b plus minus under the root b square three square is nine minus four ac so plus twelve divided by two a minus three plus minus square root sixty nine divided by two two values of a a is equal to minus three plus minus Square root twenty one over two. Now only positive sign in between will be accepted sign as it will generate positive solution. So we can write accepted a, accepted a values, a positive. So we will reject a negative only. So a will be equal to minus three. Plus square root sixty nine over two, and second value minus three plus root twenty one over two. Negative sign will be rejected. These values will be rejected. Now let's put our substitution. It was a is equal to square root x. So let me put over here. Square root x. In this place, I will write square root x equal to minus three plus root sixty nine over two and minus three plus root twenty one over two. So let me write here root x is equal to minus three plus root sixty nine over two. And second value was minus three plus root twenty one over two. Now consider squaring both sides. So I will write x is equal to minus three plus root sixty nine over two whole square. And second value will minus three plus root twenty one over two whole square. Let's apply. A minus b, you can say a minus b whole square formula. So it will become minus three square is nine. Square root sixty nine square is sixty nine minus two ab. So six root sixty nine over four. And here I will be writing nine plus twenty one minus six root twenty one over four. So this will become sixty nine plus nine. So it will become seventy-eight minus six root sixty-nine over four, 
and here I will be writing 30 minus 6 root 21 over 4. Now we can write, if you will check both the values or before that we can divide numerator denominator by 2. So it will become 39 minus 3 root 69 over 2. Denominator is now 2. 15 minus 3 root 21 over 2. And if you will check both the values, then first value root 69 is coming out 7.04. Let me write here. So first value is coming out 7.04 and second value is coming out 0 0.6261. As per our domain, it is lying in the interval of 0 to 9. So both values we will accept. So our final answer, ultimate answer becomes in terms of irrational or rational form of the root, it would be 15 minus 3 root 21 over 2 and second value is 39 minus 3 root 69 over 2. So these two values are accepted solutions for this radical challenge. I hope you like this video. Thank you so much for watching. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye-bye till next video. Good luck and take care of yourself.